I had super fun in the Call of Duty beta. I haven't had that much fun in a game in a long while. Black Ops 4 was the first COD I played in PvP. Before that, I only played the original campaign of the first Modern Warfare. And that's it. Now don't get me wrong here, I had fun in Black Ops 4. But mainly, it was because of the actual shooting mechanics. I didn't enjoy the maps that much, and I didn't like the art style. If the gunplay feels great, I'll stick around for a while, because it's such a large portion of the game. But the maps are also super important. And straight off the bat, I have to say that Modern Warfare has way better maps than Black Ops 4. Because the three lane thing, you know, it doesn't do it for me. Now this is an opinion of course, but the maps of Black Ops 4, they feel like a child's toy compared to Modern Warfare. They really do. They're so simplistic and boring. In the Modern Warfare maps, there is so much more to do. There are numerous flanking routes, there are power positions, verticality, choke points. You have to think more on these maps. You have to utilize them to your advantage. So in other words, you can outplay people more than you have to outshoot them. Which is great for me because my aim is complete shit most of the time. Yes, of course, you need to aim. You need to be able to aim to a certain degree. That is a given. But if you're out in the open, you can still get screwed over royally because you're not using the terrain to your advantage. I've heard a lot of complaints about camping and things like that. But I mean, I got up to a position, what I would call a power position, yeah? I could hold down two lanes, but they knew I was there, the enemy knew I was there, and they didn't do much about me. They sent up like one guy, I shot him, set up another one, and I shot him too. They didn't throw any grenades, they didn't take a rocket launcher to try to clear me out, they didn't use any of their streaks to try to clear me out. So I mean, they could have gotten rid of me if they really tried, but that's what I mean. If if they do not prioritize me up there, I can just stand there and pick them up one by one. And that feels good, that feels great. Then you're outplaying them. And if the enemy team is too busy just racking up kills and not thinking about clearing me out or taking the objectives or whatever, tough fucking luck. That's how it works. I don't mind the fast kind of gameplay that was in Black Ops 4. That can be very very fun. And even the simplistic maps can be very fun. But for longevity, this is more my speed. This is the kind of gameplay I do like. You have to think a bit more. It's simply a smarter design, according to me. And when they said they were going to remove the minimap, I didn't care in the slightest. I'm not a Call of Duty guy. I'm not used to having that minimap up there, chasing red dots or whatever. So I didn't mind at all. Then they brought it back, and I think they struck a very good balance here. You can see the terrain, the layout of the land, so to speak, and your teammates. And you only get red dots if you get a UAV out. And that's, that's a great balance. I think that works fine. And for us, who doesn't like the minimap that much, or don't need it, we can just jump into realism mode. And realism mode is really good. It is really good. I always hated hardcore mode. It's weird. You can just load up your pistol with whatever and shoot people in the toes. It's just about, it's only about the fast reflexes, who sees who first. But here, you have to land a headshot to get a kill, a one hit kill. And that, that, oh man, I really like that. It's a completely different skill gap, but you still have to be careful about things, more slow pace sometimes, and it, it's nice, it's nice. Still suck at it, but I'm having fun, so yeah. Overall, I'm really excited for this game. The gunplay is fantastic, the gunsmith is awesome, you can build whatever monstrosity of a gun you want in there, even one that shoots like shit if you don't know what you're doing. I think the campaign, well, that's gonna be that's gonna be a thing of its own. I'm really looking forward to that. Overall, I think this will be an extremely good game. So, a pro tip here, play the shit out of it as quickly as you can before Activision destroys it with pay to win and microtransactions. So yeah, October 25th, looking forward to it.